Do we want to do... Do we want to do standard color or standard or do we want to make her an anime weeb? Uh, shoot, I don't know. I must say I love the idea of her saying anime references. I also want to see the cartoon references as well. <laughs> we'll go vanilla then. Okay. We can do anime references next time. So here's Peacock. Oh, so th the eye things, are those just still part of her or like oh, parasite stuff? They're a part of her. Meet Peacock, Lab eight's Magnum Opus. I'm not sure if it's like so a this is experimented Project parasite or I've something. Read your papers, but mm. I'm embarrassed to but say they're a part I of her. Follow them. Okay. And she's using them to watch Project more cartoons. Peacock is equipped with not one, two. I assume two synthetic, okay. parasites. Two synthetic parasites. So they're uh, fake Zero parasites. Created one other like her. As in... The eyes themselves are one parasite, like her arms are, or no, they're both. Does he also have so the arms are each a parasite? Okay, soul contamination must be difficult, indeed. But with a oh, yeah, be puns because she, mm. she's be her name is oh, got it. <laughs> and Dr. Avian, but the eyes also generate. I can only imagine something there. The mm. So the reason her eyes are blacked out is because she actually doesn't have any eye holes. She sees through her no. arms. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and those two things down there, that's Avery, her little bird, and I forget the name uh, of the bomb. The but because she was so oh, twisted while this was going on, she just kind of poofed them into existence. I mean, look, she needs them. She mm -hmm. You need some... Uh, Sidekicks for your comedy. Mm -hmm. She's got two more. There's Annie the Anvil, and then there's there's a there's someone else. I can't remember the fuck his name. If I could drop him, I'll drop him. Yeah, her power is people just kind of bend rea bend reality though. Yeah, because she she has a strong affinity to cartoons, so everything is cartoon based. Mm. There it is. That was her getting her eyes mm. plucked out. Oh, actively. When she was young, though. Yeah, when she was young. Before she got her new powers. Yeah. That's Annie the Anvil over there. Okay. Or Andy, whatever. <laughs> I like the shoes, the slippers. <laughs> <laughs> and that's her squad of bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> that's cute. <laughs> Because <laughs> her teeth, I think, is like a bear trap. She just sticks into her mouth. Yeah. <laughs> Hot tootie fighting. <laughs> That's fun. So she's a goofball. Yeah. So now her seat is kind of going around. Mm -hmm. We're on the hunt for the skull girl. The, yeah. So that's random, I assume. It's the longer you hold it, the bigger the item, but the item is always different. <laughs> the fridge. There's actually a there's actually a an achievement for it's called drop everything and because you're supposed to use that move to see every variation. You drop everything yeah. and the last one that pops up is the kitchen sink. That's fun. <laughs> ah. Bowling ball. Mm -hmm. Theoretically, Peacock could probably do whatever the fuck he wants throughout the world, but... Oh, yeah. Just loves cartoons. Technically, the most powerful being in existence. Yeah, aside so from far. the Skull Girl. Yeah. Chip damage, bitch. The Skull Girl was just forced to do the bidding of the Skull Heart itself, though. Yeah. Which also has unknown desires, I guess. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the 
They're all a bunch of I do like balls. the head. It's great. <laughs> I do love Mr. Fortune, uh, his head. Wrong one. So this same stage was another one of these. So did they have a day-night one? So some of them have day and night cycles. Not all of them do. Okay. Okay. It's not a different stage. It's the same stage, but just a day-night one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. There she goes. <laughs> what a catastrophe. <laughs> I do love that she blows it out of her <laughs> nose, but doesn't actually blow it out of her nose. Mm -hmm. Like it pops up a secondary mouth above her nose. <laughs> <laughs> so one of the you things, still see her nose still there. One of the things that set this apart was that all of these were hand drawn at the time. You no know, digital art and everything. But That's awesome. Fuck you. <laughs> Peacock specifically, or everyone? Everyone. And okay. That's why there were so many. At the, at the time, there wasn't a whole lot of animations in there, and with each yeah. update, they started adding more, but some of them got left out of the uh, console versions because each patch would require oh, yeah. more. Some, yeah. And then Sony stuff. And because or they Xbox couldn't stuff. debug everything, and because they needed to um, make sure it worked. Fuck. Mm -hmm. Steam was just the easier way to get things out to the public. Hmm. <laughs> Teacup. Yep. Nice. <laughs> That's Cute. all forks. <laughs> Story. What is Peacock's dress based off of anything at all? Oh, I can't. Like, remember. I feel like it must be a specific cartoon, maybe, right? Yeah. It's or that the general. It's a specific cartoon style. I can't remember which yeah. one, though. But she also wants Annie. She loves Annie. Okay. I heard Beowulf coming out of retirement. And so. We're just getting a call. They got. They were under attack. The other lab they mentioned has turned on them. Oh. Are these labs secretive or? Yes and no. Not really. Okay. The experiments they do there, I think, are in some case secrets because they do some pretty fucked up stuff. Yeah. Lab zero. But the labs know each other. Hmm. The Skull Girl in. Which way did they go? They fled to hmm. New Meridian. I should visit all. See, now you're going to go towards the church or whatever? Yeah, we're going to head towards church. They always end at the church. I know you hmm. can protect everyone. And then he called her Patricia. That's her real name. Okay, when they first got her. Mm -hmm. It's her birth name. Tommy. <laughs> Get ready. Pissing me off is the last mistake those idiots will ever make. Squawk! I see her, boss! Mm. Squawk goes right over there! The fucking squad's good, though. I love it, too. <laughs> <laughs> Marie? She's the skull girl? I'm sorry, my child. Hmm. So presumably, so, well, she still has a whole cartoon stuff, but she still has. She still has some memories. of her memories. Some of them, not all. Because her memories are from a very traumatic time, and that's what broke all. her psyche. Okay. So she can remember things from the past. She just chooses not to think about it. Okay. Time to put on a show. So I assume the different voice lines would be when she makes her moves, right? Say again? The different voice lines is her moves itself, right? Yeah. Her moves and intro and outro. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I 
garbage day. I smell the bread. <laughs> then I think that dance is supposed to be an early Disney uh, thing, thing too. Makes sense. I think the sing whistling thing is very much so. Yeah. Though the wavy arms, I don't know. I never expected you. Couldn't imagine you could probably dissect each and every single like animations he does. Oh yeah, no, the, to the Skullgirls wiki has every single reference in it that she has. Can you let her write to us? As though I'd explain myself to a child, we came to stop Dr. Hmm. Avian's work, and that's what we did. You really think I'm gonna let you walk out of here alive, nurse? I don't think you have a choice. It's time to fight well, Booberella. Almost an interesting there you go. I'm surprised she doesn't but have a Booberella color scheme. I wonder if she does. <laughs> nothing more than garbage. A Booberella? Mm-hmm. Double? Hmm. It's time Lab 8's final experiment came to an end. Basically, uh, Elvira, Mistress mm. of the Dark. We'll show you weakness, lady. I, I keep, uh, I always call her <laughs> Booberella because that's the Simpsons Makes joke. Sense. Yeah. yeah. What they said. We're sending you straight to hell for what you did to the Dark. Time to kill. Time to kill this grown ass woman. I think uh, Peacock needs to make even more friends. Oh yeah, the hello nurse joke. <laughs> oh, so you specifically have that one? Uh huh. <laughs> Makes sense. Okay, standing. I don't even imagine a lot of this probably Animaniacs actually referencing. Woo! I feel like if there's anything he most embodies in Animaniacs, in terms of cartoons in general. Oh yeah. There's a lot of the Animaniacs. Thing, there's but... a lot of Looney Tunes. There's a lot of uh, Disney. Hmm. I oh, didn't even make more sense too at times. Oh, you had both. Ah, fuck. Let's leave the corpses on the ground. Yeah. They do that because uh, <laughs> Valentine actually has a level. Is it level 5 super? Okay. Where you can, um, if you do it right, you can revive one of your teammates. Okay. <laughs> it's very difficult to pull off. But you can do yeah. it. Yeah. Okay, I want to do this properly. Sounds like a lot of work in particular. <laughs> That's her level three. <laughs> <laughs> That's fun. It's great. A very mobster. Oh yeah. <laughs> very cartoon mobster. That's the whole joke. Mm. <laughs> I assume this frame itself is pretty common too. For oh, the yeah. first originals. Marie. Patricia, you should not have come. This this exact scene Do coming down here is always me. the same. My quest mm. is nearly at an end. Oh, so what see you? has he not ha yet done at this point? What do you mean? I guess Medici's. Because presumably he killed the leader and all that stuff, but what's he still doing? At this point, I think her her part of the bargain is done. Look, oh, okay, so now it's the skull girl. Yeah. Whoa, is that him? So all these people are evil, from the slave traders of Ramograd to their patrons, the Medici's. Mm -hmm. All must perish. Mm. That's her goal. Yeah. Patricia. Complete destruction of the evil people that that uh, wronged them in the past. Much yeah. You know but I mean, she, she hasn't already killed them all by now, or everyone in the town. But she's still going because there's more of them. One of these days, you'll slip up and you'll be. Presumably, at this point, then the Medici are gone. Or worse. So, at like least the all... head is. She's trying to get them all. Yeah. But they're killed. To, they're all gone to the extent that they're probably not coming back, and any other crime lord family probably takes over. In the same vein, yeah, no, it'll be a different yeah. family that comes into into play. Mm. And I'm pretty sure they go a little bit more in depth with it, but uh, the whole story with them is that they were orphans taken by the, that both same slave trade. Both of them. Mm. That's how they know each other. They were war orphans taken by the slave trade, and. Marie, Marie just is, somehow she got a hold of the heart now. and has the power and her goal is to uh fuck. 
Her goal and is Peacock to is picked hopefully... up by Lab 8. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> is it easy with Peacock to kind of... It's easier with her ult, but I gotta build the meter. Uh, okay. Because her range based at firing is seems a lot easier to kind of get in compared to her. Because the problem comes with her last form with the heart. Hitting it? Yeah. Because yeah. it's just high enough for those to be too low. Hmm. And just low enough for me to miss a bunch of other stuff. Yeah, so only one would be like your anvil, I guess. Yeah. Or my super. Wait, all, yeah. Which one do you need? Just a level one. But I'm going to blow uh, okay. the shit out of it. Mm. And if I do it too early, I'll blow the super and uh, it'll keep going <laughs> as she's transforming and she won't take the damage. Uh. There you go. And I can get you can get hit out of ults in this game, so. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> That did it. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> That's why I wanted to build the meter early. <laughs> hmm. So just the freeze frame while you initiate it, but not that you start engaging the move, you can be hit. Yeah. These are a lot quicker than I thought they'd be. Yeah. You could probably push one more. I feel more. like Annie was just different because it was longer mm -hmm. and newer. Yeah, Annie's was definitely longer and newer. Mm. Foolish child. Do you really think this is over? Skullheart's been destroyed. <laughs> right, Marie? Right, Patricia. I'm sorry I ran away that day. You stood up for us. And I ran. When I found the skull heart, I thought maybe I could make things right and punish the people that did that to you. We're good. You'll always be my friend. Got it? That makes me happy. <laughs> Tell you what. I'll pick up where you left off. Now that I beat you, saved the day, and it's rerun season, I don't have much to do. <laughs> Why not? Bloodying those mafia fools sounds like a hoot. That would be wonderful. Also, presumably, that there's no, uh, there's no collar on. It was good seeing you. On Peacock anymore, because that's you. A lot of later, bait is gone, right? Time. Yeah, I think there's some survivors. Hmm. But she can pretty much do whatever she wants now. Yeah. And uh, do whatever she wants. And she's going to do whatever she wants. And yeah. The power and capability and the, no, the time to do it, I guess. So she just broke through Lorenzo's entire mansion and fought everybody. That's Black oh, okay. Dahlia. She was another, character, another character in the vote, voting gauntlet. The <laughs> to experimenting on children now. My, how the mighty have fallen. But I mean, she could literally do whatever the fuck she wants, though. Oh, yeah, no, she could <laughs> fucking level that whole place by herself if she wanted to. Yeah, she just wants to do it the fun way, though. Let me tuck you in for your final bedtime. <laughs> Black Dolly would have been so cool to put in. It'd be a very different uh, story, though. Oh, yeah. Okay. That all relates to the Skull Girl.